What's up guys, welcome back to Destiny Updates. We've got some more information for Destiny out of E3. YouTube channel Ditto Does Destiny actually recorded some interesting things while he was there, and he was nice enough to give me permission to upload it here, so big thanks to him, link to his channel in the description below. Before we get into this though, you do have to forgive the relatively poor quality of the images and videos, because he just recorded this with a camera while he was there, you can't really do anything about the quality. Anyways, let's get into it. While he was standing in line waiting to get into the Bungie Theater as they're calling it, basically the Bungie Destiny media room, they were showing off a number of unique weapons on screen which look pretty cool, so let's take a look at them. First up, we have this exotic sniper rifle named Closing Time, definitely looks pretty cool. Next we have this sweet looking fusion rifle named Conduit F3. You can also see the FWC or Future War Cult logo on the side there which looks pretty cool, further confirming that you can brand all the things you own with your faction logo. Next we have this red hand cannon called the Duke Mark 44. It looks like it could potentially be the same one Joseph Staten was using during the live gameplay demo. Next we have this cool looking scout rifle called the Monitor S11. Also on the magazine of this one you can see another logo there. We've seen that logo before on a t-shirt and it seems to be associated with the Vanguard, but we don't know specifics yet. Next up is a pulse rifle known as Psy Umbra 2. The pulse rifles definitely have an interesting design. Now this next one looks really cool, it's an exotic pulse rifle and it's known as Red Death. Definitely looks like it's been through a lot of battle. This next one is also pretty damn awesome, it's an exotic rocket launcher known as Gallahorn, I think, I could very well be pronouncing that wrong. That one looks super sweet, and it also looks like it's the same one that was shown off in the Destiny gameplay demo, which you can see here. This one, part of it got cut off, so you can't see the entire rifle, but you can still see most of it. It's an auto rifle known as Sanctuary No. 2. And then finally, we have this epic looking shotgun known as the Silver Dollar Mark 35. So that's all the new weapons. Let me know in the comments which one was your favorite. Personally, I'm not too sure. That rocket launcher looked awesome, but I'm really intrigued by the fusion rifle. It looks pretty cool, and I want to see how they work. Now onto the next thing, Ditto Does Destiny also recorded something pretty interesting when he was inside the Bungie Theater. Basically they played this long video showing a bunch of planets, presumably all the planets we can visit in Destiny, and it's interesting to note that it included Mercury and Jupiter, which were both unconfirmed before. I mean the moon of Jupiter was confirmed, but not Jupiter itself, so that's pretty interesting. And then at the end, there's sort of an alternate version of the Destiny gameplay trailer. It's quite similar, but there's definitely a few little differences in it. Now again, you do have to excuse the poor video and audio quality for this one, and it was also played on a huge 180 degree screen, so it's pretty much impossible to record the whole thing, and hence he had to keep moving the camera around as he filmed to try and capture everything, so you just gotta forgive him for that, nothing you can do about it. Hopefully Bungie will upload a nice HD version of this whole thing soon, and if they do, I'll let you know right away. Stay tuned for more videos coming soon, that analysis is still in the works, and there's a bunch more stuff out of E3 I still need to cover, so just stick around for that, it's gonna be busy for another couple days at least. And once again, thank you to Ditto Does Destiny for recording all of this and letting me upload it for you guys. It's much appreciated. Anyways, here's the video and I'll see you in the next update.
mysterious sphere. Silently protecting us. The last city on Earth. Outside of our walls is a vast frontier. Our solar system had been taken from us. 